All right, what's going on, my FSU Seminole fans? This is your boy, Mike Jack. So I am giving you my post-game reaction, immediate reaction from Florida State versus Wake Forest. So we uh, lost our first game of the season, and we knew this would be coming. We're not going to go undefeated. We are a team that has improved from last year so far, but some of the tendencies from uh, FSU's past woes have showed up today in this game. Now, I will say, before I get into the breakdown of this game, the officiating, I'm going to get off my chest, I wasn't pleased with. I felt like they were inconsistent a lot of times, more so on our side than Wake Forest. Although we shot ourselves in the foot a lot with 10 penalties for 91 yards that we gave to Wake Forest, I feel like there were some penalties that were not called, like Jordan Travis getting hit near the helmet area when he slid. No flag. It was right there in front of Russ' face. How do you not throw the flag? But anyway, uh, Florida State, um, I will say this, guys. Coming into this game, I didn't feel like we should be ranked. I'm going to be honest. Because we didn't beat a ranked team. We had four wins against unranked opponents while they were impressive for the standards of what we had last season. I feel like this year we, we'll know what we are when we get tested against a ranked team. And Wake Forest was a ranked team and more quality opponent than everybody we played so far. And we came up short. Now, Florida State, there was a lot of things that I said. If you watched my last week assessment, the field goal kicker. I told people we cannot go into a game having moments where we can't trust our kicker. And then at the end of the game, when we had a chance to maybe go for an onside kick prior if we score, you know, we didn't even get a position to get an onside kick because we got to delay a game penalty. And it backed us up, and the kicker missed, and there we go. So, um, you know, I think Florida State defensively had a hard time playing against Wake Forest with the scheme that Wake Forest ran. We haven't seen a team that would delay the handoff and then throw it or give it to the running back. And then the O-line for Wake Forest played phenomenally well today. They controlled the line of scrimmage for the most part. Second half, we started getting more pressure, but we ran out of time. So Florida State has a lot to improve. Self-inflicted penalties was the moral of this game. Um, I do feel like Florida State, as a team, could have beat Wake Forest, but the the uh, penalties, that's what, that's what gets you. You can't have 10 penalties in the game and, um, you know, <clears throat> expect to win, especially when your defense is not really stopping the offense on the other side. So going forward, Florida State still has a lot to play for. They can still win the ACC. I do believe Wake Forest will drop another game. But Florida State really has to go all out and beat Clemson and NC State, which is going to be a real difficult task. But this team is in the right direction, but they still got a long way to grow. But hopefully they keep playing hard, keep playing with fight, and finish this year strong, and we'll see what we do. Still a long season. So go Nose. Looking forward to next week. Go Nose.